So, hello and welcome to the EEPROM 9. And after way too long, we finally have this thing working. And the uh, displays all display all nice and bright. So what we have is, if I sit up into a position that I can, we have a whole load of capacitors in series of each individual segment. We have a nice relay array driven and then we have another array of transistors and yes i could have driven it directly with the transistors to drive the high voltage but where's the fun in that relays are more fun and they make the clackety clack clack sound and then behind mr bubbles we have a little pro micro i chose a pro micro in case i wanted to do keyboard stuff and then we have here a um backlight not backlight, a um, emergency light driver board. Uh, here's another one from the same type of light. I got a whole box of them for free from an old, from a hotel on Facebook Marketplace. And uh, yeah, we've been having problems with power, but then my uh, partner behind me suggested that um, rather than trying to power it through the EDVD um, USB port here, dump the power straight into the problematic component which is this beast which kept pulling too much power and causing the usb to brown out and whatnot and then we just got it running off my uh one remaining working bench power supply or did it kind of fix that one so yeah that's actually working a treat and because all of these are in series with it with each individual element the brightness is even when you have them run just one capacitor is the brightness will go up and down depending on how many segments are lit which is not ideal for this sort of um application but now it's working so i need to jiggle this mess into a nice little cube that i can put down and then just have it sitting in the kitchen or something just running all the time and looking cool thanks for watching hope you enjoyed and yes Finally, a video. I know, amazing.